Finally, at six, tonight's trip back down the Pennsylvania road it takes us to Carbon County in the year 2001. Mike Stevens visited an artist who found life to be quite pleasant, especially if you get to do what you love. Victor Micus at work in his weatherly home. When I get a pencil or brush in my hand, it just flows. I could never play the piano. All them keys are confusing, but give me a brush and it just goes. I enjoy it. And I think uh, when you enjoy, that's important. Victor built a career for himself in advertising and design, but he could not turn off that creative flow and that turned out to be a good thing for him. Victor's album cover story comes to mind. He's done hundreds of them and he tells it best. Fellow said, I want a Spanish dancer and I made a Spanish dancer and uh, he liked it. I got a hundred bucks for that first one and uh, ever since then I was doing albums for him. And then there were the paintings, some seemingly mad dabs of color that blend together to create a striking picture, a picture often more telling than a photo. The advertising paid the bills, but the love of working came out in the art. Painting was a good release and a lot of fun. And now there is Lucky Pierre, a character that Victor sees in all of us. Sooner or later, we are going to lose at something, all we can hope for is that it won't happen very often. He's in this box here, it says, Ocean Cruise, the tropics, $35 special. He comes in, second box one, one ticket to the tropics, please. Here you are, sir. Here he's running with the suitcases. And here he is in a rowboat with the captain. Some bargain, eh, Pierre? But Victor Micus received a bonus in his life beyond the joy of creating something using only a felt marker or dabs of paint. And there's very few people can say they're happy with what they do, you know? Most people hate their jobs, I heard. Love to paint. And they say if you're happy in your job, that's the lucky few. A man who does work that he truly enjoys, who's made a lifetime out of it. He is very lucky indeed. Mike Stevens, Newswatch 16, on the Pennsylvania Road in Weatherly.